Well, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a fluid eyeliner. And you want to make sure you want to put a base and then a, a flat shader brush and take any lid color. In my case, I'm using all that, gl all that glitters from MAC. And apply it to all your lid. Make sure it's all your lid. You want to be really gentle with your eye. Then take a pencil brush and take a crease color. I'm using mulch. Sorry if I'm not showing to you the colors, but I didn't remember to show it. But yeah, just take it and apply it to your crease. And make sure you really blend it well because you don't have you don't want to have like a straight line onto your eye like for doing it and that is how it looks it's really cool and it's really really pretty then the other eye okay so I was just joking it doesn't work for me and if you want you can put some more in your crease like not in your crease like in your V and what is your V? it's like the uh, like the outer part of your crease and a little bit onto your lid but just a little bit you don't want to be too rough with it after that make sure you want to like you want to place a little bit of all our glitters on again then take a fluffy brush and start blending because you don't want to, that harsh lines so just blend and everything would look Gorgeous, I promise. And that is how it looks after all the crap you made. <laughs> then take an angle brush, and this is the like, this is what about the video it's about. I'm just taking black track fluid. I can talk black track fluid line from Mac, and. Just take a little bit. You really don't need that much. It's like really like a little. Then take any excess like in the back of your hand. And then grab your eye like that. <laughs> and start making like a really really tiny line on your on the top of your eye. You want to be really really careful when you do this. Like because one touch, like a bad touch, and everything would be bad. Like, in there. You see? <laughs> but you don't want to be rough with the lines. You want to be really, really calm. And no one is, like, hurting you. So just take it easy. Don't start making anything stupid. And I don't know if you can tell, of course you can, but my eye is looking wavier and way fuller and it looks pretty. Like, I really love my eyeliner and I don't really wing it out that much, but it is nice if you wing it, wing it out. Like, in there, I'm winging it, but just a little bit. Not that much. And that is how it looks. You can absolutely go back and fix the miss, like the wrong parts. It's not a bad thing. And also, you want to be really careful when you like grab your eye and pull it back because you can have wrinkles after all that. I would recommend if you're like even better than me on doing one eyeliner, which I'm sure you are, just oh, do it like with your open eye. I don't know if you can see, but it's not a straight line. It is, like, different. And then take a little bit more of OLED glitters. If you want to hide, like, a wrong thing. Like, I was trying to because I'm not an expert on doing a winged eyeliners. So all the wrong parts, OLED glitters can cover it up. Then just use some mascara, like curl your lashes, of course. It's a must-have for a girl, sweetheart. And then apply mascara. I'm using the Final Lash 
by Maybelline. Bottom lashes and top lashes. You don't want to forget any baby. Then I'm grabbing my Avon Color Trend in Champagne powder and just a really small brush and like um, fix your concealer or I don't know how to say it I'm such a crap but yeah just put some under eye under your eye circles make sure it's a color lighter then I'm taking well-dressed blush or maybe down mix I don't know I don't know which one I used but I'm pretty sure it's a cute blush <laughs> so just apply it to your cheeks I'm using dolly mix yeah I'm using dolly mix make sure you take just a little bit of dolly mix because it's a really bright color and I love the color so take a little bit and apply it to your to your cheeks I don't know if you can see but it's really pretty the color it makes you like if you're flashing all the time which is great there you can see. You see how beautiful the blush is? So yeah. Then I'm taking chapstick. Just chapstick. Funny. Yep. Then I'm taking a, a bright like white color with my finger. And this is my highlight color for under my brow bone. And my inner corners. And... You can use a brush if you want, but I just use my finger. So hope you guys have enjoyed, and I love you. Bye!